Shalom. I want to give all praises to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash, double honors to my apostles and elders of Great Millstone who rule well. Salutations to the Lord's hope for elect scattered abroad. All right, I'm the brother Tiles of War, back at you again with another lesson. And uh, this morning, uh, just got around to check my messengers, and uh, one, one, one brother, he uh, sent me this video clip here. And uh, this guy, he's just, you know, he's going in, giving you the scoop. And uh, it's like, you know, we we told you so, all right? You know, it's not a brag. You know, if anything, give praises. We give praises to Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai because these things are happening, all right? Bible prophecy, all right? Esau's agenda goes along with Bible prophecy. See, we understand that the Lord it's setting Esau up, all right? He's going to destroy him while he is eating. And um, like we told you, you know, the MOTB, Revelations 13, 16, that is going to come to pass. And that mark is Karagma, okay? Karagma, which is which is that, that chip, chippy chip, all right, being pricked inside the body all right and um this guy here he, he's talking about you know the barcode the qr code and that's what it's all about it's all about you receiving a qr code all right so before i even let the video play and i don't want to make a long video just want to get the information out this is um isaiah 32 and 4 and yeah you know we're gonna constantly keep going over the same scriptures so if you come across the page and you're seeing that we're reading the same scripture over and over. Well, this 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 is a song, all right? And this song has to be sung, okay? So hopefully this lesson will edify those of the whole four elect and let, and let the word of the Lord sink in, man, into your conscience. Because the scriptures say how the word of the Lord is quick and powerful and sharper than any two-edged sword. You know, it even gets into the bones and marrow, all right? Meaning it gets into your soul, man. All right, so Isaiah 32 and 4. The heart also of the rash shall understand knowledge, and the tongue of the stammerers shall be ready to speak plainly. The vowed person shall be no more called liberal, nor the chul said to the bountiful. For the vowed person will speak villainly, and his heart will work iniquity to practice hypocrisy and to utter error against Yahweh, and to make empty the souls of the hung hungry and he will cause the drink of the thirsty to fail. All right, so the instruments of the vowed person, which is Esau, all right, starting with these international bankers who are calling the shots and uh, pushing this NWO, all right? And you see Australia, you know, it's basically a prototype, all right? You got, like he's talking about now Canada, all right? They are getting rid of the driver's license, okay? They're getting rid of the driver's license and they're giving everyone a QR code. All right, so it says, for the vow person will speak villainly and his heart will work iniquity to practice hypocrisy. You know, and it's hypocritical when you look at the uh, Biden administration that certain certain ones of the, that Biden's uh, party is exempt and uh, exempt from the mandate of, of the Satan's juice, you know. But here it is, they're promoting and telling everyone to take it, all right. So Esau is all full of hypocrisy, okay? It says, and to utter error against Yahweh because ultimately what they're doing is saying that the Most High created us wrong, all right? When really, in fact, they're crying out because the Most High created them the way he created them, all right? They're the only uh, people on this earth where the blood show forth through their skin and where actually the sun, you know, is, is their enemy, okay? When the sun is supposed to give you vitamin D, all right? It's supposed to neutralize you, man. You know, give you that 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 nutrients, you know? Because the sun is, you know, uh, uh, part, of the, part of the health here on this earth. It makes things grow, all right? So how much more us as people? But the Most High created you Edomites to be the sons of perdition. He created you to be the sons of the wicked. The scriptures talk about in... Um, Romans the ninth chapter how the most high created one vessel he created one he created one vessel unto honor and another unto dishonor 
and that's you Edomites. You want to dishonor when Jacob is unto honor. And that's just the will of the Lord. All right. So they want to utter error against the Lord. All right. Because they want to be able to govern this universe for eternity. Where in fact that Yahweh Shai have promised to our forefathers, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, that we will have dominion and rulership over this earth and we will rule the world in righteousness. All right. Under the spirit and power of Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai. So anyway, it says to make empty the soul of the hungry and he will cause the drink of the thirsty to fail. The instruments also of the chul are evil. He devises wicked devices to destroy the poor with lying words, even when the needy speaketh right. Because in the video, you're going to hear him say how basically Jamaica, they was against this, you know, with this driver's license thing. And now they've been broken in over a year and some change and they all for it. And he made mention about how the TSA, you know, when they have a job right now, you know, and once this system is established, they're going to lose their job, you know, and that's the whole point. He is doing these things it's like you stupid idiots, you know, those who are break or um, who are conditioned from the mind control that's helped pushing the agenda when you're just regular folks, too. You're going to be out of a job. You're going to be caught up in the system when the system turn on you. All right, because once they establish what they want to establish, this technology, all right, um, this conveniency, you know, of um, artificial intelligence ruling in our lives and our everyday lives, you know, you're walking around as a, uh, you know, a GPS tracker for them to monitor you. All right, there's gonna be no need for you. You know, this is about this is what they call the uh, fourth industrial revolution, because that even also deals with robots. And this is not a joke. This is not sci-fi. All right. This is not a television show. This is not Black Mirror. This is reality. They're doing it. This is the NWO. And there's plenty of videos where it's showing that they don't even care anymore. They just telling you straight up, man. Straight up. All right. Uh, one clipping on the news on Fox 5. You know, the guy said, this is not a conspiracy. This is the new world order. <laughs> you know, and that's when you fluff news, man. So it says, verse 8. But the liberal deviseth liberal things, and by liberal things shall he stand. All right, now I'm going to go to the famous scripture that we all know. I'm going to read it. All right. This is Revelations chapter 13, verse 16. It says, And he calls of all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads, and that no man might buy or sell, save he that had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name. There is wisdom, let him that have understanding count the number of the beast, for is the number of a man, and his number is six hundred three score and six. All right, which the mark is karagma, the three score and six. The six hundred three score and six is the chi phi stigma. All right, and all you have to do is look this up to get the understanding, you know. And the understanding is that in these times, all right, the whole goal of this agenda that's being pushed. All right, it's for you to have that technology in your body. All right, and basically, you know, is to have that mark, you know, and that's Bible prophecy. All right, that's Bible prophecy. So I want to play this video here. I may not play the whole thing, but you know, here we go. Who oh, will be listening to this later? Listen and listen to me well. I just received some documents from um, Canada indicating that the government of Canada is now going to remove a driver's license um, or replace it rather and health cards with the QR code. Now think about it. Why would you remove a driver's license which has an image on it? Why would you remove a health card uh, which has an image on it to give you a one a new ID that has no image but just a QR code? Mm. Wake up. So the world, as you know it, is now 10 regions. Uh, on the 7th of September, Africa, the Union, and CARICOM joined together as one, and the Oceania and the other parts of the world, they have become one. So we have now 10 regions governed by the G7, which is Japan, uh, Canada, United States, etc. So the G7, what ruling over the 10 regions? And above the G7, of course, is Lucifer and all of the, these different um, persons. So now, when Canada removes 
driver's license and then you have to have the QR code to have a driver's license, you will not be able to drive unless this is what they're telling you inadvertently without the, the joke which gives you the QR code certificate, you will not be able to renew your driver's license, therefore you will not be able to drive your car. Are you catching it? Can't drive your car? Uh, so Canada is going to go all over the world, even to Jamaica. That's why Jamaica was trying to bring in NIDS, so that, but they didn't put it in a way that the Jamaican people would accept it. But now we are the brainwashing from the last year to now, they are now People are just thinking that if they give in, they go back to normal. You don't go back to normal. You die. So the driver's license, the health card in Canada, your passport will all be connected to the QR code and your cash, your bank account. It's a cryptocurrency. There will be no more cash. Cash will crash. And so this is happening this month of October for Canada. They're going to roll out. No more driver's license in Canada, October, November. They're rolling it out. No more driver's license, no more health card. Uh, and, of course, by next year, no more passport. So travel will be with, without... You see, all those people who are working at the airport now that think people need them, you will be replaced. There will be no need for you to be there. I was in Italy two years ago, and I just scanned the microchip in my Canadian passport, and the, the door opened. A lady just stamped in it. She didn't even look in the book. She just asked me for a, a page for her to stamp, and I left. And I said, why this is strange? No one spoke to me. No one asked me why am I there, because that's not what it is now. The world is changing, and they have been doing the test run in Italy and in Europe and these countries where you just go through this little glass booth, you stand in, and it takes a, it scans your face. When I was in South Africa, uh, the same uh, scenario applied. Something scans your face, and you go through. It, and it, no, sorry. When I was in Australia, that's the same thing I experienced in Australia and in Italy. And so what you need to understand, ladies and gentlemen, is that this is it. So you cannot renew your license. Those of you who have not paid up your land taxes, one of the ways to catch you is the fact that you have not paid your land taxes. Then they have the right now to come and take over your property. So you have to pay your land taxes years in advance. I know this is now, you know, this is just information, you know, a heads up. All right, you know, it's coming from a guy, I don't know who, but he seems to know his stuff, all right, because this is exactly what their plan is. So when these things start to come to pass, you know that this information was true, all right? You know, we're here to, uh, you know, be watchmen. The Lord set up watchmen as well, you know, so that you can see what time it is. The scriptures talk about in 2nd Edges 9, measure thou the time diligently in itself, and when thou seest parts of the signs pass, then thou shalt know it is the very same time wherein the highest will begin to visit the world which he made. So you're supposed to know what time it is, man. All right, Ecclesiastes, the third chapter, starting at the first verse. There's a time and season and purpose under the heavens. All right, so right now we're in that time and season that the Lord is visiting this place in which he made. All right, and ultimately, you know, we're going to see Yahweh Shai crack those clouds, man. All right, because Yahweh Shai is the one that delivers. He's going to deliver the elect, all right, the elect of Yasha Allah. Not all Israel, man, all right? Two-thirds of the Lord's people going to get, hey, you're going to be destroyed, man, all right? And the elect is going to be saved, that remnant, okay? So I'll just play a little bit more. It's pretty long, you know, uh, you know, and I ended with that, you know, he said a mouthful, man, all right? Saying stuff we already know from brothers who are watching, you know, but look, Everything is, is uh, tightening up, you know. I'm, I'm witnessing myself a new system, you know, as far as, you know, uh, going these businesses and things like that, you know, school, uh, children's school and stuff like that. They're trying to get everyone to get on board. They're trying to get everyone uh, to get on board um, uh, with this QR code. You know, going around just using this code, this code, this code. Because why? That code leads into uh, your identity, which is they want to stamp inside your body. All right. Which we know that goes into what? The MOTB, man. So let's play this video. It's really intense. You did not follow the signs 
and therefore you miss the seven year of prosperity. When the government of Jamaica told you of prosperity, four years, it was true. But now that time of prosperity comes to an end, September the 22nd, and the time of famine and hardship like this world has never known or seen before in the history of humankind. This is what's happening. So, well, that's we. That's Jacob's trouble. All right, Jacob's trouble. All right, Jacob's trouble, man. All right, and, and it's 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 a, it's sad to say we told you, you know. But it's a good thing that we said because hey, giving all praises to Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai he for wonders. Matter of fact, First Thessalonians the fifth chapter, uh, the Lord goes into it says, um, um, uh, "Ye have no need that I write unto you, for these things, for you know the, for ye things you know perfectly." That the day of the Lord so cometh as a thief in the night, roughly paraphrasing. All right, so basically, uh, the Lord already forewarned us, so we know these things. All right, so in order for you to get this QR code, all right, why is Britain going into contracts with um, funeral parlors for four years? To store mass bodies because they know that the people are going to die like flies. Listen to me and wake up. There are camps all around the world. They are building camps in Jamaica. You think the soldiers are building this camp up up in um, the in Montego Bay in different locations and in Kingston they're building camps for who? For the dead bodies because when people start to see the dead bodies that are piling up. Famous Alex Jones video where in Georgia they had those plastic coffins and even throughout the years you know I remember uh, beginning of this year there was videos showing in California there was exterminate camps man there was like camps uh, they were showing um, the creation you know like like I guess they were setting it up on how they could uh, they had a toilet in there like little prisons man so Esau got all types of uh, 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 prison you know for those who's not going to go along with the mind control, with the government, man. All right? They're going to start to retaliate, and they have no... They, the lockdown is put in place, so you're locked into an area, and you cannot leave that area. So this little play, this game that you think you're playing, that you'll be able to go in downtown, or you go up to Kingston, as you have a feel, is this not going to happen? They're going to ban you from traveling and moving and everything else until they have taken away all your liberties. If you don't wake up right now and understand the time that you're in, you don't think it's joking time. If you don't know who your God is now, you will not know then when hungry I kill you and, and, and water. Hey, that's why that's why we give all praises to Yahweh by Shimmy Yahweh Shai. Because if you don't wake up, if you're an Israelite and you don't wake up to the fact that the Most High can acknowledge Yahweh by Shimmy Yahweh Shai and repent, then that's it, man. All right. Now I don't know what God this man's worship, but the information is pretty good, man. You know, it's something to uh, take heed to. All right, just play. I'm gonna play a little second more. And I'm going to wrap this video up. Your pipes, listen. Imagine now there's no more JPS and no more NWC. And in order for you to get water and food, you have to go and show the mark. They're going to be controlling the water supply and the light. Are you hearing me? You, you will not be able to pay your bills because you don't have the QR code because cash will be removed and the QR code will become your cash. Those of you sitting down saying you will wait and see. Man, tell us that you will see it with your eye, but you shall not eat thereof. At the time that you think you will see to eat of it, you will die. This is the time to set your house in order, to put your affairs in order. When they, when they realize that people are waking up, even those who have received their mark, they're going to interfere with your emotions. Two, you won't hear a voice talking to you in your mind. It's the technology they have now. It's a weapon that they have. <clears throat> a voice will be speaking in your head. Just like when someone becomes schizophrenic, they say they hear a voice and start doing crazy things. This is what is going to happen. The technology that's on the inside of you will allow them to speak into your head by the frequency. Just like how your phone picks up frequencies and you can hear a call, so it's the same. The person becomes an antenna. And that's not. And that's not. Um, and, and and what he's saying can be can be possibly done when it comes to you taking that mark. All right, this is why Elon Musk, he has what you call the Neuralink. And there's another company that I keep forgetting the name of, which actually beat the Neuralink 
in the race of putting it out to the public because they got FDA approval on theirs. And that's brain chips, all right? Even within that neural link, that brain chip, it shows you the, 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 uh, the abilities of how, uh, you know, you had, they had a monkey using telepathy to play a game, you know, just with thought in mind. You know, and it's plenty of videos on this. So it's like a, it's like from, um, you know, what he's what he's talking about sound like something from Black Mirror. But now nah, this is reality, man. All right. This is the technology. All right. That Esau possesses. And this is the power trip that he's on to sit in the, the temple of the most high. You see. I have warned. I have warned. I have warned. Noah warned, and so today. All right, you know, so that's it. You know, I don't know what else he's going to say because I ain't really watched this full video myself, but I wanted to put that out there. Hopefully, you brothers are edified. All right, you know, uh, this is it, man. We at the end, okay? You know, and it's either go hard or go home, man. You know, keep putting up those prayers and curses upon this place. Put those prayers up for the righteous, for the brethren, you know, a few sisters, you know, the apostles, men, elders, you know, for yourself, your family, you know, and um, stay strong in the spirit, man. You know, so I want to give all praises to Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Rakakwadash, double honors to my apostles and elders of Great Millstone who rule well. Salutations to the Lord's elect. Shalom.